Hey everyone, it's me, the Otaku Fangirl, here to review episode 8 of Nanbaka. Poor Jugo, Hachime, why? You didn't need to hurt him that bad. Like, come on, he suffered enough, the poor thing. I mean, sure, he was kind of going berserk and crazy, but it was like, I mean, I think one punch is enough, you know? Take a lesson from Saitama from One Punch Man. One punch just does it, right? Right? Okay. Um, yeah, this episode... Nambaka's definitely getting a lot serious with its episodes because the beginning it was just like all this comedy, ha ha ha, but then this New Year's tournament started and everything got serial and I'm like, okay, um, and honestly in the beginning I was kind of upset they were going this serious route, but now I'm not as upset. I'm actually kind of happy they're doing that in a way because it's like, you know, they draw you in with the comedy in the beginning, and then now where we are, they draw you in with the action and the suspense and everything, and it's like, well, you know what? That's actually interesting how they, you know, like, oh, this is a comedy anime, but oh, no, we're also serious at the same time. Um, yeah, so, oh boy, though, Jugo, poor, poor Jugo got punched in Oh gosh, it's just like Hajime, no! And Uno, Uno, I took Uno's side with this because he was, you know, talking about how Jugo, you know, it's kind of, he's not good at a lot of things, and so I was just like, yeah, I mean, listen to Uno, I mean, come on! Now, Hajime was like, I wasn't trying to kill him, you know, or anything, I'm like, yeah, uh-huh, right, sure, right, yeah, you beat him up so badly that he's gonna be unconscious for a while, though in the preview it looks like he's gonna be fine, so that's good. Um... But yeah, Jugo is going to have some, um, probably they're going to extend his sentence or something's going to happen. Because, I mean, they got him all shackled up in that one room, wherever he is. Um, so yeah, I don't know exactly how that's going to go down. And the other dude that, you know, is fighting, I guess he's going to get a longer sentence or something's going to happen, you know. That'll be probably serious, and, uh, we also got to see Jugo in the past where he stabbed that guy's eyes out. Why he did that, I still don't understand why. Like, I kind of let them explain why Jugo just suddenly stabbed his eyes out, and, I don't know, maybe because he was coming after his shackles, and Jugo's like, you know what, boom. <laughs> I don't know, but, um, that was a thing, and... <laughs> <laughs> Poor Warden at the end, she was crying because she had to suspend Hajime for three days, and I'm like, aw, you poor thing. <laughs> but I mean, I mean, at least she takes her job seriously and, you know, does what needs to be done, even though she wasn't necessarily happy about it. <laughs> uh, for a workaholic like Hajime, that's, what is he gonna do during those three days, you know? Like, like is he just gonna relax and then just get angry about it? Like, oh, I can't relax, because <laughs> he's a workaholic. Uh, I'd see that be, being kind of funny if that does happen, but... As for preview-wise, I don't think that's going to happen because we see Jugo in his cell and then we also see Hajime outside the cell probably talking to him. And the next episode is called You're Empty, so I'm like, okay, we're going to continue this seriousness with this show. And uh, also, it was confirmed for a second core, so yay! It's going to continue past episode, I think this is going to be 13 episodes. Um, so we'll get an episode 14 starting in January, so yay! Now, whether or not it continues to be serious, that is to be seen, because uh, I haven't read the manga, so I don't know. For manga readers, don't tell me! Thank you! Because um, <laughs> I'm sure some manga readers might watch these reviews and be like, I know what you don't, and I'm like... No, don't tell me. Don't spoil stuff for me, manga readers. But anyway, just this was a really interesting episode of Nambaka, and just, just, I want Jugo to be okay. I'm just like, oh, you poor thing. I mean, he looks fine, but still, it's just like, oh, because when your husband gets beat up, you're just like, I need to give you a hug. <laughs> you poor thing, you. <laughs> you don't need to be, you don't deserve to be beaten up. Dang it, Hajime. I want to punch Hajime in the face <laughs> for that. And I'm like, oh, man. But, uh, yeah, that's all I really got to say about this episode. Um, Anything else? Second core? Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's also weird they decided to announce a second core this, like, I mean, sure, we're eight episodes into a 13-episode series. It's just usually that doesn't happen until after a show finishes, but whatever. Um, at least we know now that it's getting that second core, so yay! But anyway, what do you guys think of this episode of Nambaka? And what do you think is going to happen next? And I will see you guys in whatever I review next. Bye!